Hey everybody, I'm Scott Weichel. You're listening to My Kind of Country. Thank you so much for joining us on a Monday night. One of my very favorite people is on the show tonight. I'm always excited to talk to him. He's got a brand new song and has literally taken the cooperation of the entire world to get this done. And it's uh, it's such a cool song and just a great story to go with it. We're going to talk about it tonight and play it for you here on My Kind of Country. It's an honor to welcome Scott Southworth back to the show tonight. Scott, how you doing? Man, I'm fantastic. Good to talk with you, and uh, happy birthday a little bit late. You just had a birthday here recently, so. I did. Thank you very much, and, and I want to thank you for that intro. I love that. You sounded like a movie. It took the cooperation of the entire world. <laughs> and, uh, that's fantastic, man. That, that makes the song sound so cool. Well, it is cool. I mean, it, this is a monumental <laughs> task. I mean, even in today's world, you know, where we've got technology to make things like this easier, it's still quite a feat to put something like this together and uh, the song of course that i'm talking about is called that's country no matter what country and uh tell me about how this all came together scott this is such a cool thing oh absolutely so uh my buddy uh bill white who is he's a he's an award-winning songwriter but he was also a wsm uh, dj for many years um, and he's actually in the Radio Hall of Fame here in, in, in Tennessee. But uh, he came to me with the song idea because he, he had seen me doing an awful lot of, of touring out in Europe. And so, uh, so he came to me with this idea of, you know, country music is country music no matter where you are. And, and so that's what we, what we put together and we wrote it. And uh, gosh, Scott, we probably wrote this song like six years ago. Oh, wow. Five or six years ago, and I just held on to it, was trying to figure out what to do with it, and then I was thinking of all the different artists that I've been honored to play music with and, and, and play shows with and even do some writing with around, the, around Europe and, and just around the, around the world, and I thought, well, man, this would be really kind of a cool thing if, we, if I could get a bunch of people to sing on it, and, and the, the, way, the way I pitched it to everybody was, Look, we're all indie artists. We all have our, our fan bases. How great would it be to introduce ourselves to five other to six other fan bases, right? Yeah. So, so that's that's what we did, and we have uh, we we have seven different countries represented. Of course, uh, uh, you have France with Dr. J, Mr. J. Uh, his name is Jerome Descato, and he. Any time a traditional artist is playing in Europe, chances are he's the band leader. Uh, he tours uh, with with Bellamy Brothers, Ray Scott, uh, um, just just anybody that's going out there. Uh, Mo Bandy, Gene, anybody that's going to Europe, they're playing with his band most likely. Wow. Um, and then uh, uh, Andrea Benz is from Switzerland. She's a wonderful guitar player, songwriter. By the way, you may want to write her name down. She just uh, released an album about a month and a half ago that I think you'd love. It's it's very 90s country. Uh, it's very, very, very country country is what I'm saying. Oh, good. Check uh, it so out. So look her, look her up. Uh, gosh, let me see here. In uh, Ireland, Johnny Brady. Uh, I've played some shows with him, and, I mean, he packs it out. I, I've... I've I've seen his shows go for hours, and it's shoulder-to-shoulder people, and they rent out entire hotels for his shows, and it's crazy. Wow. Uh, uh, Sievert Bjordal in Norway is a great independent artist and has his own festival that, that I've been honored to play at that before. And then uh, Kevin Graves from New Zealand, he was just entered into the New Zealand Music Hall of Fame, and, uh, and he's an amazing, great, deep, baritone country singer. And, uh, and then and Glenn, Glenn Mitchell, uh, representing the U.K., uh, he, he was the band leader for, for Billy Currington, Jamie O'Neill, Darius Rucker, uh, Jason Michael Carroll. He's a hit songwriter, um, and he's an indie artist in his own right. So it was just really fun to get all these people together and, and then somehow put this, you know, that, that seven different voices. You know, some of them don't speak English. Uh, you know, as, as you know, naturally. So 
it was really a fun adventure to get all of these voices and find a way to make it all work together. Oh, I guess so. Tell me about the logistics of it. How, how did you figure out parts for everybody? And I mean, how did that all come together? Because it sounds just seamless. Thank you very much. Well, what, what I did is I had them sing the entire song and send it to me uh, without any effects or anything, just a flat, dry recording. Mm -hmm. And, and, you know, I figured that everybody would get three lines and, and then we just, we, I just went through it and listened over and over and over again to everybody's takes to decide, you know, who's, who was getting what line. And then, uh, and, and then once we did that and put it together, then, then we mixed it down to where all of the effects were the same. So it, it sounded like everybody was in the same room. And, uh, and then we brought Andrea and I in, and we, we added harmonies. And so it, was, it, it took about two years to get this all put together, Scott. I've never spent this much time on a song. My, <laughs> my, typical, my typical vocal sessions, I don't spend more than 15, 20 minutes on any song when I'm recording vocals. So to spend two years on something, was, uh, it, 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 made me, uh, it, it taught me how to be a little more patient in the studio and and it's it, uh, and just patient in general, just putting it together. Well, definitely a labor of love, and it paid off in a big way. And I know that it's already appearing on the independent charts, and uh, Indie Express has got it, and we've uh, all the DJs have got it, and we're all playing it. And I think it's just such a cool song. And folks, you can go to scottsouthworth.com as Scott's official website. We will have that information on our Facebook page for My Kind of Country, and you can. Uh, get more information on this song you can also pick up some of scott's other great music which we have also done features on here in, on my kind of country and uh, i am no bones about it i'm just such a big fan of your music not only your writing but your vocals and everything that you do is just country gold as far as i'm concerned wow thank you so much well i should probably say that this song uh country no matter what country um is really the, the, the first single release for what will be a 20, uh, 23 new CD coming out. Oh, fabulous. So that's just, this is just the, the first little taste of what's, uh, what's coming out here probably mid-year of, uh, of next year. Well, I'm looking forward to that, and I will be honored if you'll come back on the show and we can do a whole feature on your album when it comes out. Of course, I'd love it, man. Uh, any, any, anything for y'all. Well, that's great. Well, you're staying busy, too, and you've been uh, doing a lot of great shows. What's what's coming up for you this fall? Well, let's see here. Um, I have, uh, I'm playing Duke's Indie for the first time ever. That's in Indianapolis. And then uh, I'm doing uh, the, the, the Lewisburg Goats Music and More Fair, uh, and I'm excited for that because I get to bring my, my full band in and we'll, uh, we'll play, some, play a full band show. And then uh, Frank Brown Songwriters Festival comes up the 1st of November. And then I still have, uh, between November and December, I'm playing two, uh, two rounds at the Bluebird. So, uh, awesome. so it's, I still got some good shows coming up. And then, uh, and then uh, constantly in the studio trying to, trying to wrap up this, uh, this new project. Oh, man, I'm looking forward to it. ScottSouthworth.com is the website, folks. Check it out. And we're going to play this brand-new song for you. That's country, no matter what country. And we're going to play some of Scott's other great music for you, too. Thank you so much for taking time to be on the show. It's always a pleasure talking with you, my friend. Well, thank you, and thank you for everything you do for uh, for us indie country music artists. I appreciate it. Well, my honor. Folks, here is That's Country, no matter what country. Scott Southworth and friends as we continue here on My Kind of Country.